that's your sign. Then you can do the walls around them. It's the ladder. There it is. I'm going to save that footage. Well, that's not something. at all disconcerting. I'm going to save that footage for something later because you should see your name was just getting bigger, so it was like it was like moving towards the screen. Mm. Okay then. I'll give you your own intro. Why do I get the feeling it won't be flattering? Eh, I don't see why it wouldn't right, be. Let's Hi everybody, this is Big Papa Grump, and welcome to another Odd Ones episode. And today, we are going to be working in peaceful, and I will explain why, other than the fact that nobody likes to get attacked by creepers, but that's not why. And there is an actual Minecraft mechanic reason for that. Yeah, not bad, not bad. I'll have to harvest all this stuff later. Alright, so, let's go this way. Now, last episode we did the iron farm, which produces decently, you know. With pocket edition mechanics, it produces pretty nicely. This portal goes to it, but that's not where we're going today. We are going to head over to the skeleton farm and apparently meet up with Batushka, who is doing Lord knows what. Oh. We have a portal to where we're going now. Okay, good, because I wasn't fancying going that way. That's never disconcerting. Um, how do I get out of this thing? There we go. Oh, wow. Should have brought my elytra. We are currently way, way, way up above in a plains area. Uh, we're not that far. We're about 200 blocks or so, maybe 300 blocks off or away from the skelly farm. And she's giving me that stuff. Okay. Anyways, so what we're doing today is we are going to be making a mob grinder. And we're going to be using an old school mob grinder whose tutorials I will credit later because I don't exactly know who all they are. But the links will be in the video description as to who. I mean, it's an old school design, so who knows? But yeah, now the reason we're in peaceful is we're going to build this thing way, way, way up there. Now, in order to capitalize on the mob drops, you don't want anything to spawn in the caves below. And if nothing has spawned in the caves below, then you're, then you're good to go. It'll all spawn up here. So we are going to use the theory that if we don't have the mobs on until we are finished constructing this thing, nothing down below will spawn and everything will be up here because that's the thing about the uh, pocket edition is that once you enter an area and the mobs spawn below, they don't despawn if you leave the area like they used to. 
So we're going to be uh, doing that.
So it's built and let's see how it works. But no gun. You know they. It, it's 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 not a one hundred percent drop. You know, drop rate. You know. There's two. And some. Yay. Skin. Yay. Yes. Yay. I could just watch this. <laughs> yes, it's the it's the falling channel. Which she left us we get a stick. bottles. No bottles. Well, they're more useful than sticks. We only have three gunpowder though, but um, four gunpowder, five gunpowder. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. I mean, if you AFK here for longer than you know a minute. It'll uh, <laughs> it'll be way yeah, more productive. Yeah, takes a while to get going. Yeah, because I remember on the old one, you know that that we had before, it was like okay, we get like two, three, and then you know within five minutes it was just a mass of mobs, and that was when we had the uh, when we were using it as an XP grinder. So. So yeah. So job well done. Yay. Yay. All right. So that's going to be it for this one. I've been Big Papa Grump. Like, share, subscribe and all that good stuff and I'll catch you next time.